With the second pick in the 2022 NBA Draft, the Oklahoma City Thunder select Chet Holmgren from Gonzaga University. Chet Holmgren headed to Oklahoma City. You can see him sharing a moment there with his parents. The term unicorn, it's thrown around often, but it, you know, it seems to, that it may be an accurate description for Chet Holmgren. How, how many centers can shoot a high percentage from three? Holmgren shot almost 39% from beyond the arc in his one season with the Zags. And his dad actually filmed every one of his games since he was in sixth grade. And when he joined us on the set of NBA Today, he said that he wanted to be a 50, 40, 90 player in the NBA. It seems like he actually has a chance to be that, Jay. There's no question. He has that chance. He's built for today's NBA. Uh, he's a good athlete, very fluid, and really, really skilled at seven feet with a seven-six wingspan. And he's got a very high basketball IQ. He's really, in a way, like a, a baby Giannis. He's not a center. He's not a low post guy. He is a perimeter player. And you can see he's got a turnaround jumper. He's got a fadeaway. He's got that little dirt move. He hit over 40 threes on the season to go with over 100 blocks. There's been only three guys that have done that in the last 25 years. Uh, and clearly he can move his feet. He keeps his body away from big, strong offensive players that like to get into his chest. He can operate and pick and roll both as a screener and as a ball handler. He's the total package with open court ability. And, and he's, I think he's very well suited for, for today's NBA. Well, he's joining Shea Gilgis Alexander and Josh Giddy. But the question that NBA fans have out there, well, who's his game like, Big Perk? Tell us. Well, I'll tell you, if, if Giannis Antetokounmpo and Christophe Przingis had a baby, they'd get Chet Holmgren. <laughs> That's one to take, but I'll explain why. When you think about it, he's a combination of the two. When I look at him, I see the Christophe Przingis in him, a big that's able to stretch the floor. He has a nice post-up game, face-up game, turnaround game, 15-footer. When you put him in the pick and roll, he can mix it up, pop to the three, and guess what? He shoot lights out. When I look at him for us at the Giannis aspect, attack the downhill, taking up space, and once he get in the paint, he's finishing at the rim with authority. Why they have to have me in this clip? But this is who Chet Holmgren is. Do not let the body frame fool 